Hi there, today I'm going to show you how to change your pictures background using your Android phone. First of all, what you need to do is to download the application called PixArt. PixArt. When you download the application, you can get it from the Play Store. This is the application. When you download it, you open the application. There are many wonderful things you can use this application to do, but today I'm just going to show you how to change your background picture. First thing that you need to do is go to photo, select that, the picture that you want to change the background. So I'll go to my gallery and I'll select them. Um, let me use this picture. This picture that this man is pointing towards you. Then the next thing you need to do is go to click on tools, free crop. In this free crop, you have the option to erase, use loop select, and also mark. So when you mark a part, that part that is red is the part that is going to be cropped. So all you need to do is just select the part of the person or the picture that you want to crop. Just move around it. If you leave if you leave the region that you wanted to crop and want to erase you just come to this eraser to then click on it and erase okay you can also select the size of the to um of the marking tool so this is the highest so what I'll do now is that I'll pause the video and when I'm through with marking the person I'll come back okay Okay, I finished marking and it's not all that cool, but it's still okay. This is how the person is. You can actually zoom by placing your two, fing two fingers on the screen and expanding or pinching it. So now, this red region is the, the place that I want to crop. When you finish marking this, the region that you want to crop, you click on this, um, um, this done symbol this stick this stick symbol just click on it it will crop the image this is how the image is so what the next thing you need to do is to save it you select the place that you want to save it and the file format so I'll use jpg jpeg format okay then you click you will go back then click on photo again you select the picture that you want to use as the background so I'll go to my gallery again um, let me go to BBM I have some cool pictures that I saved from my BBM so to the, um, let me use this picture this one will be cool for the background so you click on the picture to load this is the application and uh, the picture that you are going to use or that I'm going to use so the next thing you need to do I don't want to keep it place the picture directly like this so I will I want to blow it just click on effects then effect under effect you go to blow you select the type of blow whether smart blow blow the normal blow motion blow focal blow so I'll use I'll just use blow then you click on the text sign okay this is how the picture is now after I blood it. You then go to scroll this bar to the right and then click on add photo. Now you can under recent photo you can select the picture or you go to your gallery, the place that you save the picture, and then select the picture. But what I notice in this picture is that when you the one that is save always have a black background around it so you just delete it and then go to add photo recent recently used click on it that one is doesn't have a black background now you can zoom it to any size that you want to add to the picture so i'll just make sure that it fit into the picture okay let me yeah I'll just place it like that and click on okay 
as you can see now the man is actually at another background at another place right now pointing at you so you can go to effect to make it look cool you can select the type of effect that you want and there are lots of effects here just depends on the one that you want okay so let me select um this light cross because it actually makes the two image fit together so that is it you just click on ok save the picture ok then you can close the application go to your gallery to see the application and there it is that is the application thanks for watching my video i'd like you to like the video comment and also subscribe to my channel for other wonderful videos. Thanks for watching.